Hey guys, what's up? How you all doing? Happy New Year to you all. It's your girl, Fields, and back from work, tired, and the first thing that comes off is my wig, yeah. But I'm not gonna pull it out on the camera now. So after the wig, the next is to take out all this makeup for me to, you know, feel relaxed and, you know, comfortable so guys today's video is all about showing you guys our steps in taking out your makeup and taking it out the right way so your skin feels so fresh and of course on flake so if you're interested in this video come on give us a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe to my channel because this year is gonna be a banger like back to back so guys Enjoy. In the dark of night, even when the sun don't shine, you and me gon' be here, baby. Cause we shine, we shine, either you and I. So my first step is the Pond's Cold Cream. As you can see, I have it already on my face, okay? I don't need to wipe my makeup, my makeup off. I just apply the cold cream on my face with the makeup. Mm -hmm. No long thing, no stress, just apply it gently, okay? No stress, just apply nice and easy, okay? Now when I'm done applying my Pond's cold cream, when I'm done applying it, I, it's time it's time to wash it off with um, warm water, or you could use a washcloth, or you could use some wipes like the facial wipes, like this one. It all depends on what you want to do. You could use the wipes to clean it off before applying the the face soap. So this is the first step, guys. So. Let me go ahead and wash it off. And the next step is to apply the soap on my face, guys. For people who do not want to wash it off or who prefer to use the wipes, this is how it goes. Nice and slow, you take it out. No scrubbing, please, no scrubbing, okay? You don't wanna look um, 50 when you're just 20. So just wipe, you see? It's getting it all out of your face, like taking it off without any stress. You take another one, a clean wipe, then go in again. Please make sure you're not scrubbing. You don't need to scrub, just gently wipe it off. You see, like on a normal day without this uh, cold cream, this makeup, especially the eye makeup, would be so difficult to take out of my face. Like I need to scrub it over and over again before I can take it out of my face. But see how it's gently sliding away. You see? So your face is good to go. Now we're proceeding to the next step, guys, which is uh, washing your face properly with a face soap, a good face soap. Personally, I use the Neutrogena face soap. I told you guys. Okay, so I'm going to use it. Here's the one I'm already using. I'm going to use it like a mask on my face and just apply it like a mask on your face. I just prepare this method. Okay. So when you're done with this method, you can use a washcloth to properly wash off your face. We already have the soap on my face. So the next step is to wash it off. Uh, preferably use a washcloth, please, because it will help uh, 
uh, scrub your skin a little bit to get off all the dirt and a washcloth is not as tough as a sponge so uh, for people who have sensitive facial skin don't use a sponge use a washcloth okay so once we're done washing off the our face with the face soap it's time to use the toner okay okay so for today I'm still gonna use the toner I showed you guys on the last video uh, let me show you guys that's the Neutrogena so you just need the toner this one or any other toner you want and a cotton wool Now there's another trick, don't scrub. The toner is to balance your skin and make it ready for the next step, okay? Avoid the under eye area because it is so delicate, very delicate guys. So just tone your skin, prepare it for our next step guys. now that our face is ready our face my face is ready for the next step what is the next step okay this is when you apply uh whatever you want to apply on your face be it the serum be it a uh, night facial cream be it whatever guys okay one of my major secrets to take care of our uh, hyperpigmentation and dark sport i have told you guys i just want to practicalize it this video so guys this is my secret weapon so it's time to use your fair and white anti touches the dark spot remover so when you get it you get another cotton wool not the former cotton wool that you use okay you just uh the spray then you look at your face where is the dark spot that you want to take out okay this is when you need to like dab it into your skin not the whole of your skin guys not the whole of your face just where you have the dark spots okay make sure you press it down make sure it's like you know permeating into your skin wherever you have any dark or brown uh, patches you apply it there guys and once you're done applying this one you can go ahead and use uh whatever you use on your face uh for me i hey guys i love to use the Vasali volcanic elixir at night gosh i, I cannot overemphasize on this product just buy it and try it out the Vasali volcanic elixir i use it at night oh it's like it's life okay and please uh while using this volcanic elixir please uh be sure to avoid your eye because once i rub it near my eye i discover that it's like you know i keep uh blinking 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 up to like clean my eye so this is my night time regimen my time all of you asking me what face cream do i use i use this oil at night but uh if i don't want to use the oil or uh, maybe i feel i've used the serum a lot i could go ahead and use my other face creams which i told you guys is either i use ponds or one minute or i use the eucerin redness relief so guys this is how you use so guys this is how you use your fair and white anti-dark sport or the dark spot corrector this is how to use it once you're done washing and cleansing your face you use a cotton wool or uh, spray this on the cotton wool and dab it into your skin make sure you press it down okay make sure your skin is absorbing it and you apply your face cream face serum or whatever for this video i use the fasali volcanic elixir and that is it guys so happy new year happy new year guys i love you all we're looking forward to uh a lovely 
wonderful 2020.